So I wanna show you something else though that is really, really cool. If you wanna go further than that and you don't wanna start getting into all the cool pedal stuff, we can go right over here to this cab rig, right? And now, if you're like me, like the, I am no pro at this. I am uh, simply a, a guy that loves to play that I'm learning all this as we do this together, but it's really simple to use. So like, even for me now, check this out. So up top, we have essentially the face plate, right? Of the JJN50, which we can still modify in real time, right? As we're doing this. But now we get to go into kind of uh, mic land, cabinet land into the room. So what we're doing right now is we literally have the JJN50, a 412 version and the 212. And what's so sick about that is the fact that I can pan them. So like, for instance, like if we want to, I can go um, with the 412, I can go hard left and the 212 hard right. And I can sit here right in the middle of these monitors. That's so sick. And also like, I can mess around with the miking, right? Uh, this, um, let's just do something fun. Let's just be weird. So we're gonna do it. Let's actually go back to 160. so much fun to just sit here and mess around and also we can adjust the levels right let's say we want to go straight up the middle with both of these like i've never i'm doing this like in real time so you guys are getting an actual jjn having fun with the plugin right so now i'm in the middle i'm gonna take that 212 i'm gonna bring that down and focus more on that 412 it's almost like that 212 is going to supplement it, right? And that's so cool. And then here's something else that you can start to do, which is really fun. You can add in that room setting, right? So more than just a plug-in, let's add the room in. So I'm adding some room. You start to feel that, right? Now, remember, I'm not messing with anything on the amp, no pedals, nothing. I'm literally just messing around with these cabinets. Now I'm gonna add more room in there, see what that does. Let's see what happens because you, you know, I never want to do too little. You got to do it all the way. What's up with the room? You can get really crazy. You start to add reverbs. You add all the room in. You can really start to. start to literally make your own universe with this plugin which is the hope of all of it so and then also another cool thing is if you have this room right it's like you're in a real studio and they go jared check the guitar and i go yeah leave it like that so the first the intro of the song feels like you're actually in a room right say so that was in the the uh that was in the the tracking room and then bringing in now the mics are up bring them up more right it's 
it's just so much fun. And also, you know, you can go in here, you can pick the size, you can pick the width. If it's a wide room, you know, whatever you want, it's, it's all on tap and it's awesome. It's, it's the, the coolest part about all this is so e it's so easy to use and the tones are so right there. I don't even really have to fight it. I find myself fighting computers a lot because I don't use them a lot because I don't really need to use them a lot. But with this, this is going to make a lot of things for me and you a breeze, especially when it comes to getting great guitar tones. So yeah, have fun. Cheers.